Well, it's really starts in the morning, but we're going to warm up very nicely today. So if you take anything away from this forecast, it's take advantage of these next three or four days. Sunday, warm and breezy today. It'll be quite breezy as we enter into the afternoon. Monday, it's just going to be warm and partly cloudy, and the same for Tuesday as well. So it's going to be short sleeves for those days. Still seeing a few areas of poor visibility, most likely just southwest Iowa here. Shenandoah, half a mile. Red Oaks, not seeing good visibility at all, and some of that is filtering into northwestern Missouri. If you're towards the metro, though, still looking pretty good outside. A ways out from sunrise, thanks to uh, daylight saving time. Our sunrise now at 7 a.m. this morning. 40 degrees outside, partly cloudy. The feel like temperature in the 30s. Feel like temperatures is getting close to freezing with those winds, especially when those winds start to pick up as we enter into the early and late morning hours. Could see a feel like temperature pretty low. 40 degrees, though, here in Omaha. 30 Red Oak, 37 Beatrice, 44 degrees up towards Norfolk. Going to see some clouds start to filter in, especially as we get into the late morning hours. Right now, almost mostly sunny skies, not a whole lot of clouds entering the viewing area. 67 degrees is where we'll top our temperatures out. Average temperature for this time of year, about 55 degrees. So that's why I got to take advantage of this nice final day of the weekend. It's also the longest weekend of the year considering uh, daylight savings time. But here's a look at these wind gusts as we enter into the afternoon. 30 mile per hour wind gusts is what you could see around 2, 3, 4 o'clock. That should taper off as we get towards the evening and sundown hours. But clouds should start filtering in a little more. It's going to get more breezy, more clouds, and temperatures elevating as we enter through the morning and into the afternoon. Lunchtime. A lot of clouds by 3 o'clock, seeing more clouds kind of push their way off eastward. As we get towards dinner time, a lot of that's going to clear out by 8 o'clock tonight. But check out the next four days in these temperatures. In the 60s, the upper 60s the next three days. If you're going to take advantage of some time outside, definitely do it within these next three days. Monday and Tuesday will be less breezy. Wednesday, 62 degrees. And that average high this time of year is in the mid-50s, so about 10, almost 13 degrees above average compared to where we should be this time of year. So take advantage of that. If we have a shot of seeing any rain, it's probably going to be on Wednesday. Thursday is when we start cooling down a little bit. Temperatures back into the 50s, more closer to our seasonal average.